heart attack is the number one cause of cardiovascular death in the world and it was linked to 9 million deaths in 2021 alone in united states someone has a heart attack every 40 seconds and every year about 800,000 people in united states have a heart attack about one in five heart attacks are silent which means the damage is done but the person is not aware of it welcome back in this video i will share eight warning signs of heart attack and what you should do during a heart attack there are many risk factors that contribute to having a heart attack including family history high blood pressure high cholesterol obesity diabetes poor diet excessive alcohol consumption stress physical inactivity smoking and lastly age your risk of having a heart attack increases as you get older no matter how healthy you are about 80 percent of people who die of heart diseases are 65 or older but over the last few years we have seen an increase in heart attacks in younger adults in their 20s and 30s Therefore, when it comes to heart diseases and or heart attack, think of the old saying, age is just a number, which means you are not too young for a heart attack. Number one is chest pain or discomfort. This is a common sign of heart attack. People may describe this sensation as feeling like an elephant is standing on their chest, and some people don't describe chest pain as pain at all. Instead, they may say they felt chest pressure, tightness, squeezing. Sometimes, this discomfort can seem bad for a few minutes, and then goes away and may reappear in hours or even days later this could be all signs that your heart muscle isn't getting enough oxygen number two is discomfort in other areas of upper body pain and tightness may spread to other areas of the body most people associate a heart attack with pain working its way down the left arm that can happen but pain can also appear in other locations including neck jaw shoulder arms and back also some people may experience tingling and numbness down their arms and fingers if you're finding this information useful at all please hit the like subscribe button and turn your notification on to stay updated with my latest health related tips number three it's sweating sweating more than usual especially if you're not exercising or being active could be an early warning sign of heart problems pumping blood through clogged arteries take more effort from your heart so your body sweats more to try to keep your body temperature down during the extra exertion number four is nausea vomiting and indigestion often people begin experiencing these symptoms before a heart attack these symptoms can get dismissed as heartburn or another food related complication if you normally can eat anything without feeling sick indigestion or heartburn could be a signal that something else is going on number five is shortness of breath if walking up the stairs used to be easy but you recently have been finding it harder and harder it could be a sign that your heart is in danger shortness of breath could come with or without any chest pain your breathing and your heart pumping blood effectively is very closely related your heart pumps blood so it can circulate to your tissue as well as get oxygen from your lungs if your heart can't pump blood well as it is in the case of heart attack you can feel short of breath number six is fatigue feeling worn out after sleepless night or stressful day is normal but if you often feel tired or exhausted for no reason it could be a sign that something is wrong fatigue and shortness of breath are more common in women than men and may begin months before a heart attack and that's why it's important to see a doctor as early as possible number seven is dizziness or lightheadedness many things can make you dizzy such as not drinking enough water skipping lunch or standing up too fast but dizziness combined with chest pain and shortness of breath may be a sign of heart pumping problem which can cause a drop in your blood pressure and oxygenation this sensation is certainly not normal feeling and shouldn't be ignored if you experience it because it could mean a heart attack is on its way number eight is palpitation when the heart lacks adequate blood supply it can get irritated due to lack of nutrient filled blood heart palpitation can range from feeling like your heart is skipping a bit to having changes in heart rhythm that can feel like your heart is pounding or throbbing changes in your heart rhythm shouldn't be ignored and especially if your palpitation are accompanied by dizziness chest pressure chest pain or fainting because this could be a confirmation that a heart attack is occurring and you should seek medical care immediately if you think you're having a heart attack you or someone nearby should call emergency services immediately it's unsafe to drive yourself to the hospital during a heart attack 
so call an ambulance or have someone else drive you while you may feel awake and alert enough to drive the chest pain could get severe that you may have trouble breathing or difficulty thinking clearly when you call emergency services the dispatcher may ask you about the medicine you take and your allergies if you don't currently take a blood thinner and you aren't allergic to aspirin the dispatcher may advise you to chew an aspirin while you're waiting on medical attention if you have nitroglycerin tablets you may also use these as directed by your doctor to reduce the chest pain if you witness a heart attack and the person becomes unconscious not breathing or with no pulse begin cpr push hard and fast on the center of the person's chest at a rate of 100 to 120 compressions a minute if an aed is immediately available and the person is unconscious follow the device instruction for using it if you have a list of medication you currently take or any information about your medical history you may want to take this information with you because it can speed your medical care even if you have risk factors for heart disease or have already had a heart attack there are things you can do to reduce the risk of having a heart attack in the future such as stop smoking eat a heart healthy diet exercise regularly control your cholesterol maintain a healthy weight control blood pressure and blood sugars limit alcohol consumption assess your mental health and take your prescribed medications remember signs of heart attack vary from person to person and they may not always be sudden or severe if this has been helpful hit the like button and be sure to subscribe for more health related videos until next time stay healthy and remember health is the greatest wealth